right guys, here comes the Regera off the truck onto the streets of Monterey. Spot number two for the day just keeps getting better and better. So after the Regera, we find the P1 HDK also getting unloaded from the trailer. Let's have a quick walk around. So this is <laughs> this is crazy. Yeah? I mean, it's got the P1 GTR style rear wing. Obviously, there's a lot of people here. It's pretty. Uh, Pretty crazy world travel. Word travels fast here at Car Week, but uh, we're getting a pretty good look at it, thankfully. Yeah, so this thing has come shipped fully equipped. <laughs> we're doing a lot of driving over here. You see the guys here at the P1 HDK kit. It's full of another set of tires. So they can really tear it up <laughs> around Monterey this week. What a crazy, crazy car, guys. Spider. Right. Nice older Ford GT. I actually don't see too many of these anymore. We saw the red and white one yesterday. Now we've got the all black striped Elite. Looking good parking Carmel. Alright guys, we found the infamous 17 mile Ferrari house again this year. Once again, another crazy lineup. Let's have a look up top over the fence. Yeah, not too shabby. Hey guys, we're at the Jet Center now. We're rolling deep. There's our R34 again. We're rolling deep into Jet Center on the golf cart. <laughs> Let's see what we can see at the Broad Arrow auctions. Okay guys, we've disembarked the golf cart. We're here at the Broad Arrow auction at Jet Center. Welcoming us, we've got a couple of old Pontiac Riley Daytona prototypes. Um, pretty funky looking cars. But there's a lot of stuff inside here at the Monterey Airport, so we're gonna go in and check everything out. 
Okay, guys, a couple of back jets here. We got the nice right, 575 4 GT, the SLR. We got the BMW Z8. Pretty nice quartet there. We've got some more classics over here. We've got the old school Lamborghini 400 GT. That is very, very nice. Check out the green DB5. Obviously, wrapping the bond plate. The OG AC Cobra, not the Shelby, so that's actually pretty rare. Jag E type. And the old Porsche 356 cab, not too bad. There's even bigger stuff inside those, so let's go and check it out. Okay guys, welcome to the inside section of the Broad Arrow auction here at the Monterey Airport. This is crazy, I mean, we've got so much stuff here. It's a huge room, look at that. Just casual Rothmans Porsche 962 sitting there. Yeah, we got a lot of stuff to look at. So let's do a walkthrough of everything. So, black 997 RS 4.0, still considered, well, I, what I consider to be the greatest 911 ever. Pure driving excellence with that one. Got the black BMW M1 here. That looks very, very good. Here we go, you've got the British Racing Green Jaguar XJ220. And behind us, if you look here, Got that nice tailor-made Ferrari F12. Nice Lamborghini Miura S. And some JDM goodness. Toyota 2000 GT, the original Japanese supercar. In this sort of creamy yellow color. Looks really, really good. Okay, so we get the red 959. And then my personal favorite here at this auction. The insane LFA Nürburgring edition in the launch orange. Um, yeah, one of 50. Just what I consider to be one of the greatest supercars ever made. The LFA on its own, and this is the more extreme version. We've got that fixed rear wing. There we go. The special wheels on the LFA Nürburgring as well. We saw the front canards. So, so good. Let's see if we can get a back shot here. Okay, guys, and a few Ferraris here. F50. Unless I go from below. The F40 here. Nice 599 GTO too. Actually don't see too many of these anymore, so that's really nice to see here at the auction. Yeah, a lot of, lot of money in this room. And then sitting, last car in the room here, sitting in the corner, the Jaguar XJR15. Uh, not as well known as the XJ220, but a lot crazier. This is essentially a Group C Le Mans car for the rowers. I'm running out of <laughs> walkway there. Uh, this is essentially a Group C Le Mans car for the road, developed by Tom Walkinshaw Racing. The same guys who did work on the XJ220S. Uh, super, super rare and limited. I actually can't remember how many of these are made. But it's incredibly rare. I'd be curious to see just how much this thing sells for. One last display outside here, Broad Arrow. They're just setting up for the Haggerty Motorlux, but we got some good picks here. That Diablo, Kutosh. Got the Diablo there. We've got some more stuff down there. The Super America. I believe that's a roof Targa. Uh, we can see the Regera down there too. So there's some good stuff hanging around here at the Monterey Airport.
Okay guys, I gave you a sneak peek of the Day Tomaso rollers. You have to stick around for the full video on that soon. That's gonna be incredible. For now, we're dropped off back here at 17 Mile. We've got the green and gold Pagani Wire BC. It's almost like a goldish brown carbon. You can see on the rear diffuser there. Uh, yeah, it looks so, so good in person here on 17. We have a lot of photographers at this shoot here, so I don't want to get up too close and ruin everybody's pictures, but do a quick zoom in on the interior so you guys can see. Green and brown seats kind of matches the carbon. Pretty, pretty sick. And it uh, looks like they might be moving it. Can we make pictures? Uh, yeah, if we just get you guys back a little bit. Okay. Thank you. And on the other side of the rest stop here, we've got another Chiron Pure Sport. This one's almost like a dark blue and gold. You can see here. And it looks really, really good under this gray lighting here. Just on the side of the ocean here in 17 mile drive. Amazing. Alright guys, I did it, I did it, I found my favorite supercar, the Lexus LFA Street Parked here in Carmel. Um, I've never seen one in silver before either, and I can confirm in person, this looks amazing. The red brake calipers accent so well with the silver. Oh my god, it's perfect. Look at that. This is a rotary engine Mercedes concept car, guys. Wow, too sick. Hey, fellow JDM fans, Toyota Chaser and a Subaru SVX. Oh, they're parking up together. That's so cool. 
Oh my goodness. Oh. There's the Subaru SVX. I've seen it around town. We just saw Club with the Chaser. We got video bond by the Blue 918 though, so. Here's a proper look at the SVX. Another rare Porsche here, guys. 997 G2RS. There's so many 991s around that you hardly ever see the 997 anymore. And um, it looks really good. These like sort of brushed gold wheels. Um, I think the ones I've seen have always been black wheels, so nice change of pace. That looks super good. Again, just street parked in Carmel. That's what we just saw roll off the truck, guys. That is the SP48 Unica. That is a special one-off Ferrari parked here at the Ferrari house. And we got another car in a bag. <laughs> the 288 GTO over there, setting up the Ferrari house. Okay, 959. And F40, cars in bags continues. It's so weird trend going on here at Car Week 2022. <laughs> there you go guys. Never know what you're gonna find in the underground parking lots here. At Monterey Car Week. The Ferrari SP3 Daytona. Unbelievable. And we've got a yellow half Ferrari Aperta over here. Amazing guys. Just amazing. There we go guys, just when you think the day is over at Monterey Car Week, you find a random Ferrari of 50. Just hiding on a side street. Not bad. All right guys, and just to top it off and make this F50 just a little bit better, check the plate. Epic win from Alberta. Fellow Canadian, good to see out here in Carmel. Um, yeah, actually the, he organizes the Euro cars and coffee in Calgary. So if you're ever at those meets in Calgary, you might see an F50. The Acura NSX Type S, the new JDM icon. Nice and rare, there's that new front fascia. And then the old JDM icon here. Got the FDRX7. Nice and clean on TE37s. JDM week. <laughs>
it's still not over guys just when we think we're going back home we find a black f50 hidden in a parking garage just car week things uh, i'm sure you guys recognize this car from a particular <laughs> youtube video in new york it is the same car so that's pretty dope not too shabby Tight squeeze, but trying to get a front view of the F50 here for you guys in black. Second one of the night for us. Oh, lean back, there we go. Almost full frame, I think. <laughs> yeah. Super cool. And last one for the night, guys. In the Just finished eating at Chili's, and we found a Koenig Specials Ferrari 328 GTS being towed by a modified Lamborghini LM002. So um, let's just walk around the front actually, get a better look at the LM002. Yeah, super modified. It almost looks like a Dakar rally truck. Really sick. And then look at the front here. The old school exotic tuner, Koenig Specials. Nice. Happy car week, everybody. Um, <laughs> what is on this car?